All right, uh, this week at Sideport, my name is John Armistead. I am manager of the IMAX Dome Theater. A lot of theaters like us are called Omni, or the first dome theaters were called Omnimax theaters, and, and some of them still are, but it's now IMAX Dome. They kind of changed the terminology there. Your average IMAX film is about 41 minutes. 41 minutes of film is 18,801 feet of film. Uh, 3,307 uh, feet of film, I mean 337 feet of film goes through the IMAX projector every minute. This is how we control the IMAX projector right here. This is how we control the IMAX sound system. Um, we also, we use a digital sound system that's synced with the movie. There's no uh, sound on the frames of film. So we're running two systems in sync with each other. We have a digital audio system that's right here. That's how we play the audio. And what's this back behind you? This is all the sound amps. So all of that's used to run the sound? Mm-hmm. All right, this is one of the closets where we store some of our films. So some of them are on platters ready to show, some of them are on wooden platters for storage. So why do we have all these movies if we don't show them all the time? Well, we, we, do, we can bring them out at, at times, different times. We're probably going to bring out um, Born to be Wild sometime around the 1st of April, provided we're open. So are we like a storage for IMAX? Or well, if they're not needed somewhere else, we, we store it until it goes to ship somewhere else. All right, uh, the lamps, the lamp in the projector is a 15,000 watt xenon arc lamp. It's water cooled and so are the mirrors in the projector. So we're running distilled water into the projector and then uh, that's how we cool things down. What happens of it if, if you don't have cool water going through? Yeah, well, it, it shuts itself off. Um, we keep a lot of spare parts. This is, this is all IMAX spare parts. We keep a lot of tools um, to do repairs. Um, the projection lamp in the IMAX projector is powered by a welding machine that's been modified. Um, so that's, you know, a Miller welder where it's got a few modifications to it. This is the unit that runs the water through the projector and comes back here and cools it. We also have to have compressed air. That's what this, this is our compressor and this is our air tank. All right, so. Let's go in the dome. All right, let's check this out. We're leaving the projection room. Uh, something a lot of people who've been in here have probably seen before. This view coming in. The seats are laid back a lot more than a normal theater so that you get a good presentation of the dome. The dome is bigger or about the same field of, as your vision. Also, your peripheral vision is very sensitive to motion, and a lot of IMAX movies play on that. So that's how sometimes movies can make a person a little bit dizzy. So next. Let's go behind the screen. Magic behind the scene screen. So where are we now? We are behind the IMAX dome screen. These are projection lamps. Each projection lamp, when we buy a new one, is $5,800. We go through about four of those a year. Wow. These are movies in storage. It's a little dirty back here. How high is this, John? Three stories. Three stories? Wow. And I noticed that it looks like a mesh from oh, this perspective. Is. So you can see through it. You can see through it, and the sound comes through the holes in the screen. Ah, so where's the speakers? Well, that's the sub-bass. 
That is the sub bass. Mm -hmm. We run 18,000 watts of audio power. Wow. I just like that in your basement. So when you're watching Apollo, that thing's really rocking the theater. When that rocket launches, you feel it in your chest. Then you've got speakers up above that. Up above that. There's some catwalks back yeah, there. Yeah, those are on the catwalks. Wow. There's six channels of audio. That's pretty cool. And when the lights are out back here, you just never know this is back here. You don't. It's just so dark. Very cool. I hope you enjoyed it. Check back next week. Um, Lou and I'll talk about some movies you may be able to watch online. For free. For free.